Hola! I'm Aurora Navarro and on this video I'm going to be talking about my very first day of recovery. Normally, you would count the very first day of surgery as your day number one of recovery, but honestly for me I was so out of it, I preferred to count day one as the day after surgery. First day was so smooth, like I was at the clinic, the, the nurses were checking up on me, there was medicine running through my veins, I mean I could not complain. I felt like I was at a five star hotel. But then, da da da. I have to go home. For some people, going home is joyful because they spent like five days at the hospital, they're tired, they just want to go to their bed. But for me, I only spent one night at the clinic. So I was like, are you sure you're taking me home? I, I mean, I didn't want to suffer pain at home. I wanted to keep the medicine through my veins. But I went home. So when I got home, I got into my cozy sofa. I made sure the space was very comfy so I could recover in peace. I decided to recover on my sofa, which was reclinable, so I could lay back down, so I could lay down and I could sit back up without any help. As the day passed, I knew things were going just wrong. The medicine was wearing off, so I could feel the pain. You know, this is one of the reasons why I did not want to leave the clinic. Nighttime arrived and I had to call my doctor to ask him if I could take any more pain medicine. Because the painkiller he gave me was just not working for me. I'm supposed to take the painkillers every 8 hours, but my body is different. So I was in pain after the 4th hour that I took the pill. By the 5th hour, I was just like... He gave me another painkiller so I could take every four hours. So first I would take this painkiller and four hours later I would take this painkiller and four hours later I would take this painkiller and four hours later you got my point. My boyfriend had a very nice system. He would set an alarm on his cell phone so he knew each medicine I had to take and at what time. I strongly suggest you do a system like that so you can be on top of your medicine because you need to be on top of your medicine. So basically my very first day of recovery, the first night was terrible. I could not sleep. I couldn't get into the right position so I could feel comfortable. I kept waking up every three, every two to three hours. I also started waking up because my boyfriend would wake me up with medicine. Actually I think my boyfriend didn't sleep either but on the next video I'm going to talk about that. The next morning after the first day of recovery, I, I woke up really early, I, I barely slept, and I just felt tired. The very first day of recovery, sleeping is, is very difficult. But then the next day comes and you have a new opportunity. It will be painful too. I mean, if you're on top of your medicine, it will be fine. If you forgot to take one for an hour, it's just... I mean, you don't want to do that. On my next video, I'm going to be talking about who should take care of you during recovery and why. Until then!